Welcome to EA Sports live coverage of the Champions Cup final. Today it's Barcelona against Bayern Munich. Let's head over to Old Trafford now for this evening kickoff. Your commentary team, Martin Tyler and Alan Smith. Well, this is a great day for the Champions Cup, the final, which is going to be contested here. And uh, it's got to be played to a conclusion. And hopefully our voices will stand up to the conclusion. It's uh, Martin Tyler here and Alan Smith. Well, I hope we rise to the occasion, Martin, and I hope these two teams do. Barcelona's lineup here. Claudio Bravo starts in goal. Javier Mascherano plays with Jared Piquet in central defence. Iniesta plays with Sergio Busquets in central midfield. In attack, Luis Suarez starts. He was suspended. He's available today. Bayern Munich's lineup. Manuel Neuer starts in goal. Benny Benascia starts with Jerome Boateng in central defence. Ian Robert starts with Frank Ribéry looking to provide width. In attack, Robert Lewandowski starts. He was man of the match last time out. Well, it could be in. Clear chance for Messi. Got to be. Messi! First shot, first goal. That's efficiency for you, Martin. <laughs> what a strike. And Suarez. Suarez! Oh, he scored. And what a first season he's having. Yeah, and just at the right moment for him. Might be a big goal in this football match. Pique. Luis Suarez. He's got two now. And this campaign has been joyous for him at this new club. Well, he's given them consistency from start to finish. And he's left the keeper looking silly there, beating him from so far out with a proper drive. Good luck here, again, by the replay of the goal. help it's coming from the left Robert Lewandowski played into the middle Schweinsteiger's in the middle he's gone with a brilliant header he's fastened onto that header Schweinsteiger looking for Robert Great opportunity. Here's the chance. Robert Lewandowski, and that's another goal from a player that they brought in for this season. And it was a very wise move, Alan. I think it was. He's uh, done himself justice. He's uh, proved that uh, he was worth all the effort to bring him to the club. Change. On the scoreline, Barcelona still a goal to the good. Substitution coming up. Keeping the ball moving, that's important. And in goes the cross. Suarez! It's a hat-trick for a player still going strong and a new club. Well, four marks to the way he has settled. How quickly he's settled at this new club. Whatever angle, whatever position, whatever power, the ball ends up in the back of the net. Oh, the goalkeeper must hate the sight of him. I'll have another look at this goal. Oh, what an unlikely finish from what a tight angle. I thought he was going to square it across the box there, but oh, he went for glory. Time in the end, a fantastic clearance. Well, that's it, that's the final whistle. They have won the Champions Cup. Well, these are moments to savor, aren't they? For the winners, they've worked so hard over the course of this campaign. No wonder they're delighted. Worked so hard through this campaign to get this result and this title. They really do seem to have a, a great togetherness within that camp a great team spirit and it's seen them well 
so up they step for the souvenirs. Small trinkets, really, but they mean so much. Well, there's only so many trophies on offer during the course of the season. And that's why it does mean so much for any footballer to be in this position, to, to be on that podium. Wonderful stuff. Such a fantastic feeling to win any football match, but to win one when there's major silverware at stake uh, almost defies description. I think they'd be delighted as well, Martin. In fact, they played well over the course of the final, that 90 minutes when they really did have to show what they got. They responded to the challenge, and that makes it all the more satisfying. Well, it's quite a scene here. Suddenly, having looked tired towards the end of the game, they found remarkable energy. Yeah, they'll keep going all night now, I'm sure of that. The adrenaline will be pumping. Great team. Anticipation, passion, excitement and expectation. It's all here in what is the final chapter of the UEFA Champions League. The sound of the UEFA Champions League anthem, a perfect addition to an already electric atmosphere. attracted some of the best players in the world over the years and it's easy to see why they all want to play for Real Madrid. Well it really is a club steeped in history and a constant pressure to win. And you know the beauty of it, for a player the challenge is the opportunity to play consistently in some of the best derby games in the world and alongside that the UEFA Champions League. Well that's where you want to be, to be at the pinnacle of your sport, that's what every player should be striving for. Off he goes. They are off to a fire. The ideal start provided by a player who always strives for perfection. Well, they couldn't have planned that any better. And it's always why big players with big reputations get the big bucks. This is exactly the type of situation when teams need their stars to shine. And this fella looks bright, really bright. Madrid have the all if important they keep on facing in that direction then the only thing he can do really is to just lay the ball off and, and he's not really going to cause much trouble if he continues doing that so I think they're defending him very very well that was too close for comfort look that's exactly the sort of stuff you want to see in the final that would have been some goal if it was on target so how will they work this one there to deal with it Knocks it through, 
Here's Robin. Through on his own. He's bursting forward. Maybe his technique a little lacking there. I thought he showed great awareness there, but he just didn't get that little lob right. Surely he's in. Off the bar. That's going to go a long way. Goes for the volley. That's off target. And the referee blows the final whistle. You could arguably say that this is the greatest night in their history. They are the champions of Europe. Well, moments like this will live forever in the memories of the fans, the players, the coaching staff and the manager. Unforgettable highs and lows along the way. And at long last, they've been crowned as champions. You know, the atmosphere coming to this match was wonderful. It's an absolute pleasure to be here and share this moment with such an outstanding team. Do you know, in my experience, this is always one of those strange feelings because, yes, you're champions, yes, you've won, but sometimes you just don't know what to do. You don't know how to celebrate.